Hello and welcome to Building Stormtroopers. So lame. Anyway, today we're going to look at the torso parts. We're pretty much done as much as we want to do on the legs. Uh, there's still work to be done on them now. Don't think you're finished. But we're going to have a little look at the torso today. And um, required for this is this pack of goodies. If you didn't order one of these, um, you can have a look at it as we go through and probably try and build your own thing. Or you can get in touch with us and, and, and get one ordered. Because it does make life a lot easier. So, here we go. Let's take out the bits that we need. Okay, this is what we need. These are the parts that I want to work with today. Let's take the elastic out. Don't particularly need that just yet. And let's have a little look at what we've got. Mm. Wow, this is somewhat more like Meccano than building stormtroopers. So, separate them out. I've got a load of little nuts and bolts. And a load of these little bent pieces of metal. So, before we do this, I'm just going to... I'm just going to test my drill bit. Right, so I've just double checked. These are M3. This is a 3mm drill. Perfect. Exactly what we need. We've got a bunch of these little bracket things. Now, because we're doing an accurate build, we're going to want to use those. If you don't want to use those, then please do stay and watch the video because you're going to learn other things. But mostly, we're going to learn about these. And if we want to adapt to a different strapping mechanism, understanding how this works is going to help you do that. So, without further ado, how does this work? Well, I'm going to tell you, and I'm going to show you, and we're going to do this together. So, first off, there are three brackets that are a lot longer. Let me show you this so we can compare and contrast. So we've got these little short ones and then these really much deeper ones. The deeper ones, of which there are three, are for the chest. So I'm gonna use these ones first because it just makes life a lot easier and then pretty much everything else is the same. These are gonna go inside something like So we're going to fit these something like that, okay? Equal distance in from the edges, which was about an inch, and then, it's going to sound funny this, but this one in the centre, <laughs> and I know exactly what you're thinking, where is the centre? But just eyeball it, let's go off, we'll work off this. I'm going to work off this. Let's get down to it, I guess. So I want it about an inch in. I'm just going to use my thumb. I'm just going to start drilling holes in this bad boy. I'm 
being a little bit more careful than maybe I would be because this is a brand new drill bit. I don't want it to tear to tear me uh, to tear the plastic. got really tiny child's hands this is when to use them so <clears throat> right this is kind of what we're looking for that's what we want I'm happy with that So I'm going to drill the other hole to get the corresponding one. Now these these are a little bit flexible, so you can use a bit of judgment. If like me you're being filmed and you've got really bright lights in front of you. As you'll notice I've as you'll notice I've I've held this one in, I've screwed that one in so that I know exactly where this is gonna go. I think this is getting I don't think that's gonna work. Push that in. Oh my god, I can't find the hole. Oh, there we go. Once you've got it, even just a quarter turn on, you can get your screwdriver in there. Okay, number one of three, complete. Right, so the first one in, I'm gonna repeat that for this one and this one, obviously. that's what we've got so now we need to transfer that to this the reason we do the chest first is because it's a little narrower than the ab section so now we want to line it up with the app section. So I've made some marks which register with the position of these brackets. So now I'm going to go ahead and repeat what we've already done. Now remember, all we've got left are these smaller sized brackets. Okay, one side of each one in. Now, I've done it so this bracket is sticking outwards, if you like, so that I can easily get my elastic wrap around it. As opposed to, let me explain that. So, as opposed to close to the plastic, it's on the other way. And I'm quite happy with that. So, I'll add my extra holes. So 
So that is our hardware in place and the brackets lined up. Where are we? Let's have a quick recap. We've got our chest, it's all trimmed out and our brackets are now fitted exactly how we want them. And we've got our ab section all trimmed out with our brackets and screws installed, all fitted where we want them. And that's the front of the torso, all the hardware installed, save the press studs, but we'll come to that later, and ready to go. So until next time, thanks for watching, and uh, I've been building a Stormtrooper. There you go, simple as that. This is how we build stuff. So if you need a kit, you can get on the website. If, however, you've seen this and you think, this is not for me and I don't have the time. Don't worry. We also have fully built commissions and fully built stuff. All, again, all on the website. Just click through, choose your character. It's all there for you. Thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time.